So we'll go to next session. Uh, Pra Prabhuji, I have one very basic question. This is Narsim of the Prabhuji. Okay, please ask. Uh, this question is regarding uh, the uh, ignorance itself. Okay. So uh, since my birth, I mean, uh, by the time I started uh, uh, understand things, mm -hmm. uh, it is uh, mostly uh, because of uh, the ecosystem or surrounding in which I uh, born and brought up. And uh, everything. Uh, yeah, everything, yes. And maybe past uh, deeds may also be, but uh, I'm uh, my behavior is or conditioning is purely based on the environment in which I, uh, I, I have been raised. Absolutely. So, uh, uh, all right. so? so uh, my living was uh, merely uh, inference based. Um, like yeah, the, oh, we are life was mainly conditioned based conditioning inferencing i mean inference uh meaning how my father reacted for a, a particular si uh, situation anger how my friends those friends and the uh people around me uh reacted so, Social condition. so uh, uh, this is actually uh, uh conditioning right right so, so Entire our life is social conditioning. That's all. Nothing else. Yeah. So conditioned by the society. Correct. So the the inherent uh, property of the brain is conditioning, deconditioning, and reconditioning. Deconditioning, not reconditioning. Deconditioning. Deconditioning. So the uh, in the case of Advaita, this reconditioning uh, is being used. Uh, to put that the abstract information there, in spite of my compulsive living, this knowledge raises a thought along with reactive thought. May I uh, say this way, Prabhuji? Yeah, go ahead. I, I mean, can you last, repeat last sentence? Uh, the uh, Good reconditioning, I mean, knowledge reconditioning uh, that I gain from Advaita, mm -hmm. that actually along with every, uh, as, you, as you rightly said, uh, upon uh, keep on doing practice, this, the uh, compulsive living that I used to do, along with this compulsive link, uh, living uh, uh, will keep on uh, coming up. And at the same time, in the background, uh, uh, along with that, this knowledge triggers another. Uh, ah, your adnana, the knowledge triggers the knowledge. Knowledge removes the adnana. Like one thought destroys the other thought. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. yeah okay. Yes, yes, yes. So basically, all thoughts are mithya. Okay. Yes, yes. But one mithya thought is cancelling the other mithya. But this mithya thought, the Amsakshi, is a higher thought. Yes, 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 yes. It's like removing a thorn. If you want to remove a thorn, you have to, another thorn is required. Once yes. you remove the thorn, the, the thorn is not required. Like that, all other junk thoughts, which is a society program which has happened to us, will remove the thorn called I am Sakshi, Vedantic thought. Yes. Very... After that, even I am Sakshi thought is not required. Yes, 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 yes. The thorn needs to be removed. Yes. You are not reconditioning it. You are unconditioning it. Yes. So both the both the thorns are gone. Both so of them are gone. Both of them are not. Yes. yes. For example, yes. right now, you are so deep rooted thought that I am a man or I am a woman. You don't yes. have to think about it. Yes. And yes. So yes. Similarly, I am bra I am Sakshi thought will become deep rooted. So you don't have to think about it. Then I am Brahman thought will become deep rooted. You don't think about it. You can have your normal life. That's called Sahaja Samadhi. Yes, Prabhupada, you got it. So now I can appreciate the Tan, uh, remembering the Tan, what uh, Bhagavan Ramana, Ramana Maharshi says. Right. I can really appreciate that now. What Ramana Maharshi has said, what Shankara has said, I'm trying to give some modern context for you. Make you understand yes. more with the ideas like brain and all. Yes, Prabhupada, I can appreciate it now. So well. Yeah. Thank you. Is it clear?
Any questions? Please understand. It is exactly like driving a car. I have shown many times. Guruji, audio is muted. So, a spiritual practice, once you understand the principles, it becomes very simple. Otherwise, it's all magic. Something happening, something happening. It's not logic, it's not magic. It's a pure, clear understanding of what's happening within us, which will help us. So, maybe that's the reason in Kannada, there is a saying called, Kaliya Varage Brahma Vidya Kalit Mel Kapi Vidya. That's all. <laughs> right? See, I have to understand, please understand. These people who go through spiritual journey, right? Somebody is, there's no background of what is happening inside. Okay. There's, they're just trying to all trying in all figuring out all ways, going to Himalayas, going to sitting in a calm place, trying to do something without understanding the mechanism of what is happening inside. Understand? So my, by, by profession, I'm an engineer. So I always try to understand what is happening at the engineering level. This is my journey. I have to understand exactly what's happening. Then I can solve the problem. Otherwise, it's a black box. I can't solve the problem. I have one more question. Uh, yes. This is regarding uh, the observation and Sakshi. See, uh, in, in case of observation, there is a motive. Uh, being an observer, there is a motive. I mean, uh, uh, the thought has a motive and it tries to observe another uh, another entity another object so so is observation uh, uh, observation uh, observation may not have the motive but the observer will have a motive see the observer is nothing but your consciousness which is reflected in your body it's called chidabasa yes yes that i understood the guy who is going through trouble in life is chidabasa yes yes so who is suffering? Ultimately, Chidabasa, which is in to totally the Sakshi. Jivatma is suffering. Illusion is suffering. Right? Yes. Chidabasa is suffering. Means consciousness identified in my body is suffering. Correct, no? Yeah. Pre to be precise, stored information is suffering. No, 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 no. Information cannot suffer. The conscious entity can suffer. No, stored, I... inf stored information which is got illum illumined by... Uh... The uh, Chaitanya is suffering. See, basically, you have to say the conscious entity suffers. It will use the memory, it will get trapped in the memory, it will identify the body and get suffer. Yes, 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 Prabhupada, got it. So now, that entity is doing sadhana. Sakshi or Atma doesn't do sadhana. Yes. yes. So that yes. entity says, that entity is a motivation. I have to get rid of the suffering. Yes. So the teaching is for that entity that you are the observer, you are Sakshi. Yes. Yes. Okay. The observer has become identified with the body mind complex. Yes. The yes. observer has to be told, okay, you are Sakshi, my dear. You are not a body mind complex. You have to be told. The observer has a motive to observe. Oh, okay. To get rid so, of suffering. Okay. Essentially, yeah, the teaching is for the buddhi to kill the uh, ahankar. No. The teaching is for Jivatma, which is identified with the buddhi. Okay. Huh? The package, right? Yes. Atma cannot under, understand anything without buddhi. And buddhi, buddhi itself is an instrument. Together, this package is understanding. Yes, yes, Prabhu. Got it. Got it. Okay. Shall we go to the so, next topic? So, may I say, initial step, initially, it will be an observation. Uh, later, it becomes sakshi. Uh, there is. No, you uh, are always there is sakshi. No... Yes. You, see, you cannot become sakshi. You are always sakshi. 
అప్రోక్షానుభూతి Yes, Prabhu. Thank you. Okay. We'll go to the next topic.